Hello everyone, this video is about definitions of terminologies in kinematics. Kinematics is a branch of physics about movement or motion. In our syllabus, we only talk about one dimensional motion, so the directions can only be to the left or to the right, upwards, downwards, and so on. So the, for the sign convention, it's up to you, just be consistent throughout the calculation. For example, if positive means going to the right, negative must be to the left, and so on. Displacement is a factor quantity, it has direction and magnitude, so we have to state the direction actually. And distance is a scalar magnitude, so it has only magnitude. And displacement, path doesn't matter, in distance the path matters. We care about the whole journey, but in displacement we only care about the end result. For example, ABC, AB 10 km apart, BC 30 km apart, if we go from A to B, to C back to B, the displacement is just 10 km to the right because we start at A, we um, arrive at B, so only 10 km apart. And if we go from A to B to C the, to B, the distance is 10 plus 30 plus 30, that's 70. Displacement distance. Velocity is related to displacement, so the displacement was 10 km to the right. If it is traveled in 2 hours, the velocity would be 10 divided by 2, so just 5 km per hour to right. But the speed is, because we are covering a distance of 70, 70 divided by 2, we get 35 km per hour. Another example, let's say we go from A to C back to B. From A to C, we go 100 km per hour in 4 hours. This means the velocity would be 100 over 4, 25 km per hour. The speed would be also 25 km per hour. The velocity as we go from C to B, 70 to the left km per hour. The speed is also 70, but for the average velocity, we are using the total displacement, which is 100 to the right and then 70 to the left, so only 30 to the right. 30 divided by the total time, 5 hours, so 30 over, over 5, we get 6. And for the average speed, we get um, 170 divided by 5, which is 34, basically. Hey, this is actually hours. Not kilometers, that's time. Hours, hours. And definition of acceleration. So if we are going 36 km per hour in, yeah, this is the same as 10 meters per second. So let's say 10 meters per second. And after 2 seconds, we step on the gas and we go faster now 30 meters per second. The acceleration is therefore the change in velocity. So 30 minus 10 at 20 meters per second in 2 seconds. So 20 meters per second over 2 seconds, so the number is 10 obviously, then 20 divided by 2. The unit is meters per second divided by second, which is second over 1. So we keep change flip, we get the unit of acceleration meters per second squared. That's it, I'll see you again next time.